Number one, what does the line in section A slant upward? Because he is going away from his house. Number two, why are the lines in section B and D horizontal? He has stopped moving. Section B is where he stopped at the store, and section D is where he stopped at a friend's house. Number three, the price of a cable company services increases at a constant rate over time. Would a sketch of the graph show the price starting at zero? Explain why or why not. Then sketch a graph to show the price over time. Yes, it would start at zero because when time is zero, the cost would be zero. Number four, suppose the cable service price in problem three increases as stated but and then stays constant for a limited time before increasing again. Explain how the graph of this situation would differ from the graph in problem three. The graph would still be going up, but there would be a straight horizontal section in the middle because it would say it stays constant. So that would be a straight horizontal line. It would look like this. Number five, Adele starts driving home from work. On the way home, she stops at the grocery store. Adele then drives home from the store at a slower rate than the first part of her drive. Sketch a graph that shows Adele's distance from work compared to time. So, distance from work, we're starting at the bottom. She starts driving home. Then she stops at the grocery store. Then she drives slower. Notice the difference between the first section where she's driving fast and then the last section where she's driving slow. You have to show those differences. Number six, Jacob and Angel are riding bikes on a trail. The first part of the trail is steep, so they ride at a slow rate. Halfway up, they stop and rest for several minutes. Then they slowly continue up the steep part of the trail. After reaching the highest part of the trail, they ride down at a constant rate that is faster than they rode up the first part of the trail. Sketch your graph to show the distance compared to time. So the first part is steep, and so they ride at a slow rate, so I show it going up slowly. Then they stop and rest, so that's a straight horizontal line. Then they continue going up slowly, so again, a straight, a slow incline. Then they ride down at a faster rate, so it goes down quickly. Number seven, sales of computers at TechSmart decrease at a constant rate for the first few months of the year. Then sales level off and stay the same for a couple of months. Sales decrease again for a couple of months and finally increase gradually through the end of the year. Sketch a graph to show the sales compared to time. Explain your graph. So it decreases first. Then they level off and stay the same. Then they decrease again. And then they increase gradually. Gradually means slowly, so they're going to go up slow. Explain the graph. The graph goes down when the sales decrease. The graph goes up when the sales increase. And the graph is a straight horizontal line when the sales stay the same. Number eight, write a story for a qualitative graph. Sketch a graph for your story, then write a description for each segment of your graph. So, my story is my distance from home 
over time. So, I start in the morning by going home, by driving to the gym. I stay at the gym for a short while before I drive to work. Once I get to work, I stay there for a short while before I go home. The graph increases when I'm driving away from home. The graph decreases when I'm driving home and the graph stays the same, stays constant when I am stopped.